Hi, this is Daniel and you're watching Collab Crush. Uh, first, let me say Happy New Year and a huge thank you to everyone who has been watching over the last several months. Now, we started this channel back in, I believe it was in May, and it started out mostly as an experiment. Uh, we weren't really quite sure what to expect, but we've actually been really pleased with the response so far. So uh, thank you all for watching. Uh, I'm really looking forward to uh, working on the channel and putting out more content over the coming year. Which brings me uh, to the point of this video. Uh, today I wanted to do something a little bit different. Uh, instead of doing a tutorial, I wanted to take a little time to talk about some of the things that I've got planned for the new year on this channel. So first, as you probably know, uh, the collaboration track, like, like all other Cisco tracks, is being updated. And so in February, uh, February 24th, I believe it is, uh, there'll no longer be a collaboration CCNA. So if you're like me and you already have a CCNA in collaboration, that's going to be converted into just a regular CCNA. Now, of course, you can still get a CCMP in collaboration, and uh, that require the requirement for that certification is going to be only two exams now instead of four. Now, the first one uh, in the new set is a core exam. That's the collaboration core 350801. And then you have to choose uh, one other concentration, and that can be with uh, collaboration applications, uh, for example, uh, Unity Connection or I Am In Presence, uh, or there's a concentration for call control and mobility services, and then there's also Cloud and Edge Solutions, and of course, uh, programmability and automation. Okay, so for the core exam, uh, that's sort of the entry exam for not only the CCMP, but also the CCIE. Uh, that new certification guide is in the works. Uh, it's being written by Jason Ball, who was a co-author for the uh, CIBND official cert guide, uh, if you guys remember that one. Uh, and he is the sole author for this new collaboration course uh, cert guide coming out later this year. And as it happens, he's also writing the official cert guide for the Cloud and Edge Solutions concentration. Now, I'm really excited about this. Uh, I'm going to have Jason on this channel here next week for an interview, and uh, we're going to dive in and talk about his new books and some of the other new study materials that Cisco has, Cisco Press has uh, in the works for collaboration. So stay tuned for that. Uh, that's coming up real soon. Now, some other things I've got in the works. Uh, throughout the year, I'm going to focus on some other areas. Uh, for example, we're going to do a whole series on uh, how to best study and prepare for the exams different uh, learning and memorization techniques that have worked for me over the years and, uh, and some of my colleagues as well. And uh, especially we're going to talk about how to get hands-on experience and not just book learning, but the experience with uh, equipment, labbing, and so forth. Labbing, that's really uh, essential for getting through uh, your certifications, I think. Uh, and it's especially difficult for collab people, I think. Uh, I'd say, in fact, it's one of the largest barriers for people who want to get into collaboration. Uh, is getting a proper lab set up, uh, particularly because it can be very expensive depending on what kind of resources you have available to you. But uh, I'm in the process of exploring some alternatives that uh, may be really cost effective to anyone out there trying to get their hands dirty with the equipment. So uh, stay tuned for that. I'll, I'll have more details about that a little bit later. Now, related to that, uh, though, we're also planning to do a series of videos that focus on building your career with Cisco. Now, Cisco in general, yes, but a focus mostly on collaboration because, you know, that's what we're all about here, uh, collaboration. Uh, but we're going to talk about uh, how to go about looking for a job, where to search, um, how to search. Uh, we'll talk about your resume, uh, talk about how to interview and all that. And of course, uh, we're still going to do tutorials like we always have. Now, I've gotten a lot of requests over the last few weeks for MRA and Traversal. So, you know, we'll go ahead and uh, finish up the Expressway series with uh, one or two more videos on that. Uh, and then we're going to move on to some other topics. Now, one of those topics is going to be WebEx, and uh, there's a mountain of uh, possibilities there. Uh, we have WebEx calling, uh, there's video mesh, there's hybrid integrations, hybrid call connector, uh, hybrid conferencing, lots to talk about there. So uh, all of that will be coming up a little bit later this year. I'm also planning on doing more videos on programmability. Now, uh, the response I've gotten for programmability so far uh, has been a little bit mixed, uh, to be honest. Um, but, you know, APIs, uh, automation, programmability, all of that, this is actually one of my favorite topics uh, to talk about and do videos on. It's something that I've invested quite a bit uh, over the last year, year and a half. And uh, I've got a lot of really cool projects uh, that I want to share with you guys. So 
you can look for more videos about that in the coming year as well. And as promised, we're also planning a series on CMS, uh, Cisco Meeting Server. Uh, as well as uh, more tutorials with the CUCM. Now, we haven't really done a lot with uh, the CUCM in a while. Uh, I, I know that, uh, and I know that some of you have been requesting them. Uh, but don't worry, we'll definitely get back to, to some of the basics after a while. But, you know, there's so much in the collaboration space, uh, in the collaboration space that it's really hard to cover everything. Uh, but of course, we'll do our best. So just stay tuned for that as well. Okay, uh, that about does it for this one. If you guys like this video, go ahead and subscribe if you haven't already. Uh, that's it for now. I'll see you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching.